it's me again. Welcome back to another one of my Stay Gold podcasts. Uh, today, what I'm hoping to show you guys is how to make a green screen work. So here we have footage from our end of the semester projects last year in front of a green screen. When using a green screen, make sure you light it right so it appears green so you can actually take the green out in post. Like in this one, we won't be taking out the green, but we were just shooting against a dark background, but this would probably not work as well. So, um, this is our lovely green background with our actresses on it. You're going to go into your video effects and search for keyer. We're just going to handle the regular keyer today. So, drag that straight onto your image. Boom. Lost that. You lost all that green. Uh, this one, we have a little bit of uh, feathering on the hairlines and stuff like that, but in, sometimes you can get it really, really clean and you can zoom your image to get rid of these edges later, which is what I'll show you how to do in my next podcast. And so the point of a green screen is you want something to appear behind your characters. So you can go ahead and drag in any photo or anything. I have this one of Gabe. <laughs> so um, <laughs> we have our death penalty video clip featuring Gabe as the backdrop. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. So you can always go in and if you, you take the strength down of your green screen, so we get, you know, there's your full green, gradually more of Gabe as we increase the strength. Um, we can, there's a feather tool somewhere on here just to get those edges, see with an actual image behind it. You can see that it's a little bit cleaner, especially over here. So that is a basic, basic green screen tutorial. Um, yeah, thank you guys, and stay gold.